guys welcome back to another video and today we'll be going to pick up another truck i know that we went and picked up a project truck a while back and i never posted any updates on it that's because that truck didn't end up too well we had to end up selling it so we're going to pick up a new truck and you may have noticed that we're not at the usual house that's because we actually moved from Twins River Lake to Cody Sevens Town. Uh, it's a great little town. From all the people that I've met, it's a really nice town. Man, I wish I had my shot. Man, I wish I had my shotgun. I would shoot that bird so fast. But everything, shooting, all that is perfectly legal here. But at Twin Rivers Lake, since it was a city, you couldn't really go out and hunt or do very many things like that. But this truck that we're going to pick up, the results of the build will be at the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. And we will talk more about the move towards the end of the video as well. But we're in the first gen Dodge. We got our big American flag held high. We got the trailer hooked up and it looks high because it's it's on a it's on a hill, but we're going to get in the truck, we're going to drive to the dude's house, and see if the truck's really worth what it, what he has it posted as. I mean, he only has it posted as 2000 and you'll see why whenever I get there. But let's go check it out. So, we just got in the truck, and I don't think his house is actually too far away from where we live. So, and he didn't, ex he didn't, you know, give me very good directions to his house. So I'm just going to try to find the place. Um, whoa, looks like we ain't going that way. Uh, I'm just going to cut through here and um, get on this little road. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try to find this dude's house and from the directions that he gave me. Um, but yeah, he's not really that far away from us, so it really won't be that far of a drive, but we're going to drop the truck off at my mechanic's place, and he's going to work on it for us, so, it, and he's really good, so it should be done, you know, like a day or so from now, um, I hope. And, yep, here's the dude's house. You can kind of see the truck sitting there. I'm just going to pull in right here. Uh, I'm going to get out. Guys, I looked at the truck, and I like it. As you can see, I got it loaded up on the trailer. I know I didn't talk very much while right as I pulled up because, you know, the dude's kind of old, and I didn't want him, you know, he, I'm, I didn't want to record in his, you know, his privacy, so... We got it on the trailer. As you see, it's kind of, it's got a few little bits and dings. It's sitting on the rims in the front. Um, it comes with a very nice hitch, though. You see that? It's very nice. Um, but, yeah, we're just going to get it back to the house. And, well, not, well, not the house. We're going to take it to the mechanic shop and see what he can do with it. Um, so yeah, we're gonna head over there and I think he should be able to get it done in a day or two. So maybe it won't take too long, but the results of the build will be in the end of the video and I will. And I will talk more about, oh, God, I forgot about this. But, um, the reason we moved was because I could just, I, I could not stand living in a city. Because, I mean, you couldn't do a whole lot there. I mean, there was, you had a, you had a few nice people that would like you, you know, but, Really, it was nothing really spectacular, really. It got boring, 
so, um, yeah, I took the shortcut to his house instead of taking all the roads and stuff, but, um, hopefully, the truck will be done a lot faster than the other one was, because the other one just, it didn't work out. It, it just didn't work out, but uh, we're pulling up to his house right now. I don't know how he made those logs on the table. But we're pulling up to his place right now, and hopefully he'll be able to get it done pretty fast for us. As y'all saw, he's kind of in the middle, middle of building a pond back there. So... I don't exactly know how long it's going to take, but I'm just going to pull in right here and drop the truck off. It does drive a little bit. It's pretty slow though, as you can tell, getting it off the trailer. Um, well, there's another ding in the back, but he told me to just park it right up under here, if it'll fit. Ooh, that's kind of tight. That's, I don't know if it'll fit. Um, she might barely fit. Uh, good enough. Uh, we'll let him deal with that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, hopefully he'll get it done pretty fast. I'm sure he will. He's a fantastic mechanic. But, we're gonna head back to the house. Oh, but stop sign. Oh, well. And hopefully he can get it done. But, um, let me know if you guys think it was a good buy or not. Personally, I think it was. But, um, kind of missed the turn to go to my house. That, that's, see, he doesn't live that far away, but I just took the weird way to his house because, um, we were coming from that other guy's house. So, I'm just going to park the truck in here and just leave the trailer attached and hopefully he'll call me and tell me that the truck's ready and we're back guys and as you see I'm sitting right out here um at the driveway because we are actually on the way to go pick up the truck it's been two days and a week actually a week and two days and it's finally finished and he said he parked it around back so that's how I'm gonna try to get my trailer in there is that way um he painted it it it's all freshed up ready to go he said it looks good so we'll, we'll see Oh, I see it already. I see the front of it already. Let's get that. There you go. Just like that. Oh, look at her. Look at her, boys. It's not exactly the red I had in mind. Um, it's kind of more of a pink than the red I was looking for. Um, but I can fix that. Um, this truck is definitely gonna be in some more videos. It was gonna be kinda just a, a cruise around truck, I guess. But I think after what he's done to it, I think she's gonna be a uh, show truck for us, be the next thing we put in the car show. We got our Bel Air in there right now, so maybe she'll win. The SEMA truck didn't win. It got beat by a Bel Air. Very clean Bel Air, actually. But um, I put my Bel Air in there, so this might be the next thing we put in the car show. If so, y'all go vote on it whenever the car show votes open up again. Um, right now, the voting's going on for the Bel Air, so... <coughs> We'll see if it wins or not, but we're going to get this little girl loaded up on the trailer, and, um, 
get her back to the house and uh probably end the video off right there but tell me what you guys think of the old the new truck um kind of rolling coal all over it with the old Cummins but oh well um we might cruise around for a minute or two see how it drives but this is a new truck I named it Cherry Bomb because I thought it was going to be a brighter red than this. Yeah, I thought it was going to be like a brighter red. Which is why I told him to put Cherry Bomb on the side, but... Oh, well. Um... I think we're just going to pull in over here. Oh, I got to get my driveway fixed, but just pull in right here. Get in the old truck. Alright guys, I think I'm going to end the video here, fill the old truck up with gas, and end the video here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.